You might be familiar with Later as a scheduling platform for social media. Many people use it for Instagram, but it actually does so much more. I recently started using Later in place of both Buffer and Hootsuite because on both of those free plans, you're pretty limited in what you can do. Enter Later, which for free, by the way, you get a ton of value. You can connect to a whole bunch of different social media accounts and you get 30 free posts per month for free forever. Immediately up at the top, you'll see that you have the option to connect to a whole bunch of your social media accounts. It's really easy to connect on later. You just look for the plus symbol on the platform that you wanna connect, add your social profile, and then sign in through that specific profile. It's super quick, it's super easy, and it only takes a minute. Once you connect your accounts, you can decide what you do or don't want to post to. I'm going to stick to LinkedIn for now just so I can show you how to set this up. First, let's take a look at the view. There's a week view or a month view, so you get a pretty good overview about what you are or are not posting. Let's zoom back in. When you want to schedule your posts, what you'll need to do first is upload any media into the media site on the left-hand side. With later, the media uploading is always your first step. There's a couple ways we can actually upload our media. You can click the upload button here. You can connect it to your drive or your Dropbox, or you can simply drag and drop whatever media you want as well. Quick note here, you can't upload PDFs. You can only upload JPEGs or PNGs. Once you've got the image uploaded that you want to use, we have more options to actually schedule it. We can simply drag and drop into the time that you want to get it scheduled. And when you let go, you'll automatically have an option to write a little extra for your caption. You can add emojis. You can also save captions, which is pretty cool. If you have a template that you want to use, or maybe there's a certain number of hashtags that you want to use over and over again. You can mess around with the date and time here if you need to. And when you're done, hit save. You can also click on an image that you want to upload and look over for the create post. Basically, it's just another way to look at a calendar view if you don't want to drag and drop. And if you post something that you actually don't want shared, a single click will open the details back up and then you can discard the post. If by the way, you want to delete any of the platforms that you've connected to, you're going to go down here to settings on the left hand side, look for social sets and access groups, hit the details, and then scroll down until you find your lists. It's pretty easy to remove them. Once access is removed, that option will no longer be at the top of your screen either. Because Later's platform is genuinely 100% free, unlike things like Hootsuite, where nowadays you can only post five times a month or Buffer, which allows you 10 posts a month, you can totally plan your entire month's worth of content for free. For free, for free, for free. I love free tools. So for me, Later definitely takes the cake and is honestly my favorite simple social media planner.